One of my favorite tools to use within Google Docs is called the Explore tool. This is a great tool to help uh, students and staff uh, have the ability to insert pictures at, uh, at a click, as well as even find additional information without having to open up additional tabs or, uh, or go outside of the document. To find the tool, you have a couple options. One of the ways is when you click on the tools tab bar, you'll see the Explore tool is second from the top right here. One thing you notice here is that little symbol. And what you may or may not have noticed at this point is we have that same symbol down here. And of course, when I mouse over it, the Explore tool also shows up. So once I click on that, the tool will be engaged and uh, it creates this side window for me. So if I was doing any kind of research project or any kind of work or having students do something of that nature, I may type in something such as ecosystem. And when I click on that, it gives me a few options. It'll give me some web-based results that relate to ecosystem, whether it's definitions or uh, something here such as BrainPot. I have the ability to access something from my drive that maybe pertains to ecosystem. And of course, what I'm looking for right now is images. So when I click on images, I can see a variety of different examples of the ecosystem. If I found something I liked, what I could do is I can click and hold that image and drag it over right into my table. When I let go, my image will be populated right there and be placed in the cell. What you may have noticed is it does not disrupt the integrity of my table. It may have pinched, uh, may have moved it up and down vertically, but it does not uh, affect the orientation or stretch out the table where it gets very uh, confusing and sometimes stressful for uh, staff and students. It will insert the picture within the space that it is given and uh, will be placed uh, relatively nice and, and easily and cleanly within your, in your document. And that's just a quick way to, to use the Explore tool. And uh, on another note, the, all the images here are all Creative Commons, so there's no worry pertaining to copyright or things of that nature. And uh, so that's a bad bonus.